Here's one thing I want everybody to know. I don't know if it fits in with this section or not, but what the spirit beings, the angelic beings, Jesus, Mother Mary, anybody, Buddha, what they want with you is not subservience. Those days are over. Uh, they actually, they're telling me right now, we never wanted subservience. We <laughs> want a partnership. We desire to be co-creators with you, not that you're always begging for something. And that's kind of how we've been trained, Virginia, to beg God, to beg the divine. Oh, please, please, please. I'll do this for you if you'll do that for me. Now, what kind of relationship is that? It's not. If you had a friend and every time they saw you, they said, can you give me this? Can you give me that? Oh, if you'll just give me this, I'll be your friend. No, they want you to love them and appreciate them. And I tell people, they say, well, I don't really have any love for Jesus or Buddha or whoever you're trying to talk to now. And I say, the next best thing to love is appreciation because whatever you appreciate grows in power and the blessings that get bestowed upon you as you begin to communicate with the divine directly, they're just astonishing. Things in your life move more smoothly. You feel like you're in a cocoon of love and you feel like somebody's got your back because a whole bunch of somebody's got your back. You're in partnership with the divine. <laughs>